Hey, what's happening everybody? Like Hannah would say right here, we're out on the ice and we are back chasing ice muskies. Finally, been doing a lot of Bay Quinty, just came back from Nipissing and we were out here in Quebec, zone eight, chasing big fat ice muskies today. Should be a great day. We just got the whole spread set up. We got 20 discs set all around us. This zone we're allowed 10 lines per person. We are five people today, but we only have 20 lines out. Uh, it seems once you get over a certain amount of lines, it's just more hassle than anything. So 20 seems to be the perfect number. Just came off a full moon and it should be a day where muskies are absolutely snapping. We got our major coming at 12.54, so we're hoping, just hoping, that we can get a couple fish on the ice today. Um, Hannah and Steve came with me last year in the boat, and we had a really good day. So we're hoping to get them their first ice muskies today. So without further ado, let's get into the Otter Monster Lodge. We got the heater on in there. We're just gonna relax, kick back, wait for some flags to pop. Hope you guys enjoy the video. It's gonna be a big fish day. Let's go. Okay. So we're just gonna check. It hasn't spun, but that doesn't mean anything. So the angle's this way, so the person that's gonna fight the fish can go right here. You want me to actually? Yeah. Absolutely. Think there's something there? Hmm. It's definitely slanted. Yeah, it's definitely a fish that took, a, took the bait. It's just sometimes if a pike comes and it's a, too big of a bait, he might drop the bait. Like right now it feels like I don't know if I'm dragging the bait on bottom. I kind of think he dropped it, maybe. Yeah, look at that finicky, eh? A small fish, yeah. A big fish will eat it one shot. And he dropped it. Well, that's weird. He, I don't see any tooth marks at all. Nope. Could just spit it, though. Small fish, I'd say. Probably a pike. Flag number two. Oh, it's spinning. It's spinning. It's spinning. Oh yeah. She's on. Stopped. Okay. Right here. I saw it spinning when we were walking up. We're good. It's coming back to us. There's no, on it though, you think? There's no way to the bait. I just have slack line. So he's obviously taken line and now he's... So we'll just try to be really quiet. Because he's like literally under us. <laughs> yeah, I just felt him. Yeah, he just he's like literally like right here right now. Yeah, I just he's still there. There he is. Yeah. Set it hard, hard, set it hard. Pull, pull, pull. Keep pulling. Keep pulling. Keep going. You still got him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's on. There you go. Uh, I don't need him right now. If he wants to go, you oh, let him go. Oh, oh, there you go. Let him go if he wants to go. Let, let, just let, yeah, let it go back through. Okay. You got this. Patience. Take your time. Once I see the leader, I'll try to guide his head up the hole. There you keep. There's the leader. Keep going or let him See go? him. Just wait. Oh. See him. Oh, there he is. Good fish. Really good fish. Wait, oh, wait, yeah. don't pull Ooh. anymore. Right on. Okay. Nice. Let's Way go. Way to go. Let's go. Banana. Let's go. Forty-five. There we go. Yep, forty-five. Okay, so I'll put him back in. All right, we got him. Let's see him, Hannah. You can lift him out. I'll take a video, Steve. Nice fish. 45 incher. Hannah's first ice musky. Yay. Really good scrap on it. After losing that fish this morning, made up for it. And we're gonna get her back. Head in. Yep. Now hold the tail. Both hands tight. Yeah. It's okay. She's she's gonna go. She's gone. She kicked. <laughs> Way to go! Right on, babe. Way to go, babe! So you just so when you tired yourself out, you just yeah. So what I would like to do with these yeah. is like I put it in between my legs, yeah. and then I'll keep one hand tight, yeah. and I don't use this because I find it a pain in the ass. Sorry, I probably messed it up. 
I don't like a lot of people do that. Um, think about bundling it in their hand. Yeah. And a lot of people also, when they set the hook, the fish turns and comes at them, and they always think like, I lost them. But like, nine times out of 10, you like gain that slack back and the fish is there. All right guys, so if you're new to the channel, we caught that last fish on a mackerel, but gonna be putting a sucker on now. Just using quick strike rigs, one right behind the head. That's usually the first hook to grab the fish because as he swallows that minnow down head first, that, fit, that hook will be perfectly positioned. And then the back hook, just going right by the tail. Just in the meat, not at all in the bone, so it pulls out if needed. And uh, as you can see, we only got maybe five feet of line out. So we're dropping that sucker down. You can see the air bubbles that came out of his head there, but you wanna make sure they're sitting like that, so. With the suckers, I find they have a little bit of air. Just give them a couple bounces like that. Normally they'll settle. Yeah, that's perfect. Dropping it back down. Now I'm using this stick that's here just because I don't want a disc pulled down a hole. So we're setting our stick across the top of the hole. Putting our disc on top. We have good indication the disc isn't down under the snow and it's not hard to see the flag. And then we got this secondary stick here to let us know where all of our flags are all the way around our tent. And that's the first fish of the day. Now time to get Andrew one. Let's go. Well guys, we have not been fishing too long at all. We've already had that one false flag. Steve was making everybody burgers, such a nice guy that he is. And we we're all sitting in the tent. He spotted that first false flag. Fish just seemed to take a bunch of line and then drop it. We weren't back in the tent. 10 minutes, that first flag coming 10 minutes before major, and then 10 minutes after major, Steve spots the second flag. Ba-ding, ba-dang, fish on the ice. 45 incher for Hannah, super nice fish, hooked perfectly, hooks came out, minimal time out of the water back down the hole and uh, we are going back to the tent to finish our burgers now because I am still super hungry. But what a good start to the day. One fish, two flags, just to start a major. I think we'll have another fish to come. And uh, for all you guys wondering about these sick shades that I'm wearing, Waterland Co sunglasses. I uh, worked with these guys last year and uh, just got my second pair from them for this year and absolutely amazing glasses. I always used Oakley's or Costa's in the past and um, using something a little bit different out of my comfort zone but these glasses are top of the line. Honestly the best glasses I've ever used whether it be glare from the sun, glare off the snow or just glare in the boat. This cuts it all down and just helps you rest your eyes and see way more fish. Yeah, Waterland Co. glasses, I'll link them down below. And uh, hopefully we still got another time for another fish. The sun's looking to come out. Pressure change happening right after full moon. Big fish are roaming. Let's get another one. Let's go! Haven't seen it move at all. Yeah. Let's hope he didn't take a swipe at it. I will. I want to see if he's still on. Oh, he's on. Oh, yeah. Come right here. He's pulled like almost the whole disc. Well, we're all preoccupied. Okay. Here, set it. Hard. Pull. Yeah. Let your line drop. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, boys. It's okay. That screwed up. Oh, yeah. If he's on, he's on. <laughs> Very, I think I lost one fish all of last year that came off like during a fight. No, you could leave it. Yeah? Yeah, it's just more stuff for it to get like caught on. I see. We could pull on him a little more. Oh, he's, he's heavy. Yeah, he did pull on him. He's there. stuck down there good. Oh, wow. Wait a sec. Something's happening. There we go. Thank you. Caught in the ice. Thanks, boss. Okay, he's getting close because he just turned direction. Okay. Okay. Leader? Yep. Yeah. Now he's gonna go crazy. Oh, it's about the same size. Okay, right on. He's got a really bad hook though. Okay. On the underneath of the head. 
Just leave them in the hole like yep. that? Yep, yep, yep. Do you want me to hold this? Oh, oh wow, man. That was a good grab. A little bit smaller. It's all right. Yep. A 40? 40. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, 40. 40. Third flag of the day, second fish landed. Yes, sir. Nice warm temps today, so still got to be fast with our fish, but don't have to worry about eyeballs freezing, so you can just slip his head in. Hold his tail. He'll he'll tell you when. He'll give a really. There he goes. Let's go, Tyler. Let's go. Two in the bag. I told you when we're back in the tent. We're gonna get another one in a half an hour. You absolutely did say that. I want to see one come like out there. All my biggest, biggest fifties on the ice have always come on that corner all the time. All right. It's the closest spot to the deepest water. Fish this three. Is a good section, right? Yeah, this is the big fish section. So you want me right here? Oh. I'll here, I'll give you money. If there's something there. I hope so. Yeah. That'll He's be. there. Atta boy. He's there. There we go. He's under you now, Dish. Yeah, come over on this side now. Ready? Yeah. I'm getting the prone angle right here. Pull? Yeah. Just hard? Yeah. Feel oh, yeah. him? Oh yeah. He's there. It's a pike. A pike. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> I freaking bet. <laughs> hey, that's a cool looking pike though. Okay. <laughs> I pulled the shit <laughs> <out of> him. <laughs> he almost jerked him through the hole. <laughs> yeah. There we go. You want you a picture? Eat? No, you can just throw it back in. My guy. Watch your freaking fingers, bro. Hey, what? He made a bloody mess. He absolutely did. Okay, he didn't even take 10 feet of line. Well, he, I think when I pulled him, I damn near knocked him out. From yeah. give, so, I gave him car so wood. Theory, bam! theory of the day is that the big fish are actually on that side. Now. <laughs> <laughs> well, not a muskie, but a pike is definitely welcome. Four flags now, three landed. That pike was hooked a little bit deep, a lot of blood, but that seemed to be good. We just dipped him back down and she's gone. So it's 2 p.m. now. And like I said, four flags, three fish landed. I think we have time for one more. Let's see what we can do. Beauty day. Beauty march day. <laughs>